This is question four from paper one of the 2015 National 5 SQA Maths exam. We're given a couple of brackets and asked to multiply them out and collect like terms. So let's have a look first at what we've got. In the first bracket there's two terms. In the second bracket there's three terms. Now when we're multiplying out, what we're wanting to do is to make sure all possible multiplications are done between the two terms in the first bracket and the three terms in the second bracket. So we end up with six terms altogether. So let's have a look. And we'll do x times the x squared. That will be x cubed. If you're not sure of that, x times x squared, x times x times x. There's three x's multiplied together. That's your x cubed. Then we've got x times x. That's x squared. And then we've got x times negative 2. That's negative 2x. Now we move on to the negative 4. Negative 4 times x squared. Negative 4x squared. Negative 4 times x. Negative 4x. And negative 4 times negative 2. That'll be positive 8. Now let's look for like terms. The only term in x cubed is this one here, where we've got one of them. So 1x cubed. The two terms, there are two terms in x squared. There's plus 1, minus 4. 1 minus 4 is minus 3 of them. So 1 of them, minus 4 of them, minus 3 of them. That's your x squared terms. The x terms, there's a couple of x terms here. Negative 2 and another negative 4 of them. So negative 2 minus 4 is minus 6. So minus 6x. And the constant at the end plus 8. So we've got our x cubed minus 3x squared minus 6x plus 8. 